everyone. Thank you so much for joining me today for another video. I am going to do a split base on this 12 by 24 inch canvas using uh, white and black as my base colors. And then I am going to use these three colors. This is iridescent gold. This is transparent red. And then this is Bordeaux red. So we shall see how it turns out. I don't want a lot of pink. I know that I'm gonna get some probably, but we're gonna do everything we can not to. So I think what I wanna do is do black up here, white, and then some black down here. doesn't have to be perfect like I said because I'm going to be putting my colors right here anyway and I'm going to start with this beautiful Bordeaux red in the black I'm going to put it in the black just right here there we go and right here Okay, and I'm only using three colors, so, uh, besides the base, of course. Then I'm gonna add a little bit of this transparent red. Now what this is gonna do, I hope, putting it in the black, yes, it's gonna go in the white, because I'm gonna blow it in the white. Um, but I'm hoping by putting it in the black, it will prevent it from turning pink. If I get a little bit of pink, that's all right, too. There we go. Okay. And I think I'm going to drizzle a little bit of white in there, even though I've got this other white. There we go. Just to give it some brightness up there and down here. Okay. Let's pop the air bubbles. Let's see how this turns out. I like the design. It's gonna give me the negative space up here, which is what I want. Give me a little bit of design in the middle using my thirds here. Very pretty. Ooh, I like it, I like it. Got a lot of paint, look at all that paint in the center there, hmm, but I love this. Uh, I gotta get some of the paint out, it's way too much. I'm gonna blow some areas, so I'm just gonna work on some details. and I'm just gonna place some gold. I don't like this. 
This is Maddie. So I'm going to there we go. Just keep working at your painting. I love the composition. I think it's really pretty. I love having this blank negative space up here. This got a little muddy. I had too much white, which, you know, it happens. So I may put more color and go ahead and blow this out again. Yeah, I think that's really pretty. I like that. I'm gonna bring you down and show you the wet results and then I'll show you the drag results at the end. All right, here it is. I think it's really pretty. I did make a couple of alterations off camera. I wasn't happy with the middle here, so I ended up putting a little bit more of the red and the gold. But I think it's gorgeous. Look at the cell reaction. So pretty. I'm glad I added that in the middle. And look at this little pink pocket over here. It's it's transparent red, but it looks pink. I'm sure, because the white mixed with it. But there's deep, rich colors. And then you got some brightness from the white. And I love the composition. I like the white river going through the middle, the negative space at top. I think it's just really pretty. All right, I'll show you the dried results. These are the dried results. I added some touch-ups, as you could see. I needed a little bit more gold up here, so I added some. But I think it turned out really pretty. I love the smokiness of some of these areas, like right over here and down in here. I love that smoky effect. So pretty. And you can see the gold. This is not varnished. But yeah, I like it. And I love the river of white going through the middle. I just think it's really pretty. I'm glad I went ahead and redid this area. Wasn't happy with it, but I think it's beautiful now. So yeah, I think it turned out really pretty. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please think about doing so. It is absolutely free. And until next time, you have a great day. Bye.